This is looking downstream of where another one of the weirs was and what we did was placed a lot of this woody debris, these big tree trunks, upstream and downstream to partition any, any silt that was released when we pulled the weirs out. Again, it's working really, really well. Less daylight on this site, so a little bit less weed growth, but it's still quite spectacular. And again, the, the pool's kind of maintained itself, else it's scoured out something new. This is where the weir was, bang on here. And then looking upstream again, we've done exactly the same thing, so tree trunks fallen everywhere. The big tree across the channel wasn't us, although I wish it was. There's a little bit of a legacy, you can still see where all the, all the sand deposited behind the weir, a lot of that's still there. Um, which is fine actually, because in between that, looking down amongst the woody debris, the way it's scouring out that gravel, and there, that white patch there in particular, is quite, quite spectacular really. So again, amazing trout spawning habitat, really good invertebrate habitat, there's loads of rotting wood, there's loads of things to live on and things to eat, and... Um, yeah, very, very good. Very pleased.